Hello gaming world and welcome to Winter Survival Simulator. This is a demo and so we're going to get started here. Let's see, press any key. There we go. Okay, we're going to do a new game and I'll bring you back when it's loaded. Oh gosh, I believe I'd like to fell off. Oh my gosh, bear was coming after him. Oh, what, what the hell just happened? Well, you ran from a bear, dude, and you fell. So cold. I can't feel my fingers. After spending the night outside, your body temperature has dropped drastically. Your hands are frozen, which means you are unable to interact with anything. Stand next to any heat source to get warm and regain full control over your body. Yep, your body temperature can be tracked in the top right corner of the screen. All right. Quest started. The long night. Oh goodness, we gotta go that way. Oh, I love the sound of this snow. This is beautiful, y'all. Beautiful game. Find a heat source. That's what we gotta do. It's our quest. I've got to figure something out. Yes, you do, buddy. I don't know what I'm supposed to pick up or what I'm not to do. It's I can't do nothing. I can't get anything off of that. Frozen stiff. Oh, come on, we need a heat source. This is beautiful, y'all. Oh, it's a cave here. What the? Yeah, what the? God, I have to be careful. Yep. Your sanity is lowered by your poor condition and fear of dangers lurking in the forest. The lower your sanity, the closer you are to madness and further away from survival. Hallucinations are one of the first symptoms of losing sanity. Harmless at first, dangerous later. Yep, be careful when exploring. For example, wolves will intimidate you and lower your sanity. Wild animals may injure or kill you if you approach too closely. Alright, we've seen a wolf go through there. So we don't want to go that way. Alright. My gosh, I got to still keep going? Oh, they wolves all over there, ain't it? Come on. Sneak around the wolves. I don't know what that was. What was going on? That kind of hurt me a little bit. Oh, I love that the branches move whenever you hit them. Oh. I, I just want to go home. Oh, my gosh. I thought a heat source was here. Come on. 
Oh, is these vents a heat source? Yes. Body temperature, up right corner on the screen changes according to the ambient temperature, upper left corner. Depending on the weather and your equipment, the ambient temperature will feel different. Natural heat sources like this geyser can warm you and save your life. Tip, find and remember the locations of natural heat sources in case of emergencies. Yes. All right. Oh, he's warming his hands up. Boy, he's got scratches and little better. cuts. Oh, no. No, no, no. Run! Oh, my gosh. Run, dude, run. I ain't even got time to look around. This thing is... Whoa! Wait a minute. Oh my gosh, they tore me up. Alright, load checkpoint. Evidently, I took too much time. Yeah, we done read that. Alright. Now we gotta outrun these wolves this time. Oh, that feels much better. Oh no. No, no, no. Run! Maybe I got one or two steps quicker this time. Okay, we gotta hit that right here, just right. Not this again. Oh, well, that broke and threw us down. Health bar represents your physical condition. Avoid danger such as wildlife, hikes, and take care of your other basic needs so that. Your health doesn't drop to zero. You can find the health bar in the lower left corner of your screen. Thank you very much. My leg. I need to take care of this. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Some activities leave negative effects called debuffs. Debuffs make your survival harder, such as frozen hands, or in this case, a sprained ankle. Over time, you'll learn about other debuffs what effects they have, the most importantly, how to get rid of them. Tip, a sprained ankle limits your movement. One way to remove a debuff like this is to find a med kit. The cabin here. I should check inside. How are we going to get up there? Oh my gosh. I guess we got to go round a little bit. Yeah. Oh man, there ain't no door back what here. What is wrong with me? I have to pull myself together. All right, I see ya. Shut that door. All right. Nice. Grab that. Bring the ankle. Oh, med kit. There we go. Everything you pick up goes straight into your inventory. The size of your inventory depends on your equipment. You can drag and drop items into the quick slots for easier access. I for inventory, 
and right mouse button to interact. Okay. Much better. Still. Okay. This cold is killing me. I need to do something about it. Fireplace and shelters you already use, you only need to add fuel to light them. To do this, open the fireplace UI and click on any fuel item in your inventory. For example, wood chunks. Once you are happy with the amount of fuel, light the campfire by pressing light up. Go ahead, fuel. Right mouse button. Okay. All right. Let's add that. And then light up. There you okay, go. he's got a fire starter. This thing's still on. I, I used to have one of them. For later. Okay. All right. That's enough for one day. Press F to toggle the flashlight. Okay, it's already on. So, an old bed. So maybe I can sleep, huh? Is there anything else in here right now? Yeah, this is a little demo I found on a team. So I thought I'd check it out. And it's going to be a new uh, survival game for us. Is it Don't dark outside? You're too exhausted to go out. Okay, all right. Well, we can't do nothing else in here. What is that under there? Maybe we'll find out later, huh? This Go to sleep. Fucking trip. I hope the others are doing fine. Press space bar to wake up. Sleeping restores your energy, but the rest of the stats will diminish over time. Carefully plan your sleep and make sure you have the resources to replenish your body after you wake up. The sleep length is preset during the tutorial. After, you will be able to freely choose the length of time. Okay. Oh, Quest complete. Terrible night. Right. I have to go back there and get my stuff. All right. He's got to go back there and get his stuff. Retrieve your gear. Is there a map? All right. Let's check out uh, this flashlight. Get the wrong thing. Um, my hat is torn. Yeah, I'm going to have to. Only got four slots right at the moment. Clothes, consumables, craft, and... Okay. So, nothing's clickable right now until I... God, I want these tools. Don't know if I'll need them yet or not. But, anyway, nothing's grabbable in here or anything. All right. Where we got to go? I don't believe that open, ain't it? Alright, let's see here. Do we have a marker? Um, hold on a second. Alright. Okay, we've got to go 30 meters here and get our stuff. Whoa, 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 whoa. Be careful. You might slide. This is a game you can slide down and fall. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> goodness things are happening there you are 
canteen. The quickest way to quench your thirst is eating snow. Take note that it replenishes your fluid slowly and lowers your body temperature. You can find natural resources of water as well, but be careful. Be careful with hot springs as their waters are harmful to drink. Okay, and to eat snow is G. Shit, it's empty. Although, there is plenty of snow around here. Okay. Well, that's enough of that at the moment. Alright, we got to go back. Let's see something right quick. Where's my canteen at? A way to your backpack. Wait a minute. Okay, I got to get up there. Can I go here? Whoa. Oh, it keeps pushing me off. it be quicker but I'm probably gonna have to go around or well, I am freezing now what in the world how did I get up there okay I guess I'll end up having to go around This is beautiful though, ain't it? Look at that, the water's running there. Can we drink that? Oh gee. Look at that snow. Got to get over there on that. Oh, I tell you what, you do slide in here. Can we go up this little walk spot? Evidently not. I don't want to fall back down there. Oh my gosh, I got to cross another one of these. Thank goodness it didn't break that time. Bear tracks and footprints next to it. It doesn't look good. Oh. I have to check it out. Your instinct will show you all the additional information about your condition, points of interest, and even your surroundings. To toggle instinct mode, hit Q. Okay. 
on your way to your backpack. Oh, we can already start picking up stuff, huh? Okay, I gotta keep a watch out for stuff then. Exactly what that did. We don't want to get stuck down in there. I bet you I'm gonna have to run and jump across here. Better be careful. Oh my gosh, well how did it get over there? Oh jeez. Come on, that's up. There we go. Okay, inventory. What do we have? We just got more inventory. Follow the bear tracks. Why would I want to follow bear tracks? Follow the bear tracks, really. And get up there. All right, I got to keep my eye out. There's not a map yet. This is a big issue. You are frostbit. All right, none of those are stuff I can get. There's anything in there, anything I can get. Bear track right there. It says follow the bear track. Well, I had to come to that spot. Press Q. Oh, as long as you've got that pressed, you can see it. Okay. Well, let's go in this direction. Well, why come it's telling me to go back here? Or this is just the start of it, I guess. Keep worse. on going. I hope they're okay. He must have some other people he was with. Our traps go this way. Oh man. I should be able to warm up here. Man, somebody's clothes is torn to pieces and blood. Where is uh nothing I can grab there? Where are they at? Oh, they go around this way. All right. 
we got to start getting some of them little grass things and all too, I'm assuming for uh, water. I mean, for making a fire. The trail ends here. They probably reached the other side, but now the bridge doesn't look very stable. I'll find a way. Mm. I'm just not ready yet. I think I saw their camp on the way. Maybe I can help myself to what's left. Investigate the camp. Alright. Well, I guess we'll go back this way. There's not nothing in the bushes or anything I can grab, is there? Not yet. Oh, why come I couldn't get that while ago? Nice. Uh, uncooked food. You can find different types of food which will affect your hunger differently. Cooking food is the best form of processing a meal. But, for that, you need a fireplace. Old food will not fill your stomach much, and sometimes you cannot eat it at all. It's hmm. about time to head back. I really need to eat something. All right. Well. Let's go back to the camp. Boy, that looks warm. I was hoping something would light up in here. I remember those little grass things was lighting up, but I don't see anything at the moment. How about these little rocks? Can't get nothing. None of those grass, little thistles, whatever they want to call them. Oh. Come on, give me some more grassy things or whatever. I know they got to be used for something. Of course. I'm out of wood. I have to cut a tree. Hmm. Poor sanity. Alright. Find a tool to cut down the tree. Anything up here? Nothing. Probably outside. Nothing in any of these boxes. Oh, there's an axe over yonder. Right here. What do we have here? All right, open inventory and assign the axe to a quick slot. Okay, pressing the number assigned to the quick slot will equip the axe. The larger the tree, the longer it takes to cut it down. To assign axe to a quick slot. Okay, yeah, we got that. To start chopping, hold the left mouse button. All right. My gosh, it takes a while to open inventory, don't it? Where's the axe at? Oh, okay, finally. I didn't have anything showing up. I mean, I didn't have all. Let's, uh, let's find a tiny tree. There's one right here.
Come on. Five. Oops. Really? Okay, there we go. Boy, you got to be close up on these things to pick stuff up. All right, is that all I got? No, there's another one. Get plenty of wood. Because it's going to be a long day. Anything else I can pick up? about this one come on hurry up There we go. Get just a little bit more wood. All right, let's go in this house and try to warm up. And put our axe away. And shut the door. Okay. Two, three. We'll do that and light it up. All right. It will take a while. Maybe I should look around a bit. Find fresh water. Okay. Refill canteen. Cook the food ration. All right. Let's see here. Raw potato and cooked food ration. Well, uh, are you, uh, Let's see if we can put it down there, and then get out of here, and then use number two on the fire. We'll see it. It didn't show. Get out of that, jeez. Number two. Come on. Who can fire? Select recipe cooking. Come on. Let's drag it from there to there it is. There we go. Oh, it's got to go all the way to the top. At least I'm getting warm. Cook the food ration. And then optional is refill the canteen. Dehydrated, and I'm hungry. 
Um, where is all my slots now? Come on, hurry up. We've got that. So, well, sir. But it never tasted so good. Now, time to right. rest. Canteen. What are your actions cost energy? When energy drops to zero, you will faint. If you faint, you will. Be exposed to weather conditions as well as lurking wild animals. To restore energy fully, you need to sleep. Think of energy as the amount of time you can spend exploring before going back to sleep. Strategically, energy management is the key. All right. Here. Nothing in it? Okay. Well, I've got to go and loop and get water in my canteen. Come on, open the door. Why won't the door open? Now I guess it wants me to take a rest first. Lord, have mercy. Something knows I'm in here. Oh my gosh. That was close. If this bastard approached from the other side, I would be dead by now. Okay. Refill, investigate the shelter from the outside. Okay, but I got to fill that canteen up. That's why they didn't want me to go outside. They knew the bear was coming. Well, that was part of it. Okay. Oh, the bear. Them bear tracks. It's bleeding. The water is over there. I should fix this right away. Activate the instinct mode to find out what's the shelter status. Interact with flexible, fixable objects once you've collected materials that they require. Fixed shelter allows you to sleep safely overnight and maintain a warm temperature. You'll always, you will find ways of sleeping in the wilds as a last resort. Remember that being exposed to nature can kill you. Let's go get this water right quick. Now there was a little uh, Breaking from the open the canteen to the quick slot, press the number sign. Okay, yeah. Number 
number two. Well, I've got to walk around, try not to get down in there and Quest completed. Now, let's take a drink. No, I didn't want to fill it up again. I wanted a drink. Oh, potatoes. Well hydrated. All right, let's fill it back up. Get out the water, dude. Alright. We're well hydrated. Now we'll go back to the camp. I have water. I have food. I have a roof above my head. It's hard. But I can do it. I have to. Okay. Yes, you do. Just don't let that dang bear get you. I got to fix this. Oh, you got to go get those sticks around there. And then I've got to end this because it's been long enough. Oh, I thought I seen some sticks around here earlier. All right. Is there any sticks? I mean boards. Not that I see you, not yet. I don't know where the boards would be. Come on, close that door. That was a pretty good door then. Oh, okay. Crafting table. You can craft items on the crafting table. Pick the crafting recipe on the right side and click craft to craft a selected item. Put in a select new recipe. Okay. All right. Boards. Okay. And um, we can't do this multiple times. All right, we have 10. Okay, it's not great, right. but it will keep me safe. But still, I've got All to right. cover the roof somehow. Well, I can reach it from here. Oh, I got to have uh, some of that cloth or something. I got to do that fabric. Do I have any? Oh, uh, what does it take to make that? Fabric. And the back made from old parachute. Good hold for emergency shelter repairs. Okay. Well, I'm gonna have to end this right here. Appreciate everybody for being here. Please subscribe, like, and share. And uh, I appreciate it. Thank you. And uh, I love you. Bless you. And everybody have a great, fantastic day. Thanks, everybody.